Okay, wonderful. Well, let's do this problem. So it says, oh, I'm sorry. Name, name the period three element with the following ionization energies. And these ionization energies, it says, are in kilojoules per mole. Okay, so 577 kilojoules per mole, et cetera. And write its electron configuration. Well, the electron configuration shouldn't be difficult for you guys once you uh, figure out what the element is, okay? So remember, when we're identifying elements by uh, successive ionization energies, we got to first figure out where the big jump is. And we're going to figure that out like qualitatively, okay? We're going to say, okay, well, that seems like a big jump, what, like a thousand, but that's also about a thousand too, okay? But then when we get here, that's like 8,000, right, something like that? And then we're to 4,000 and then 4,000. <coughs> so the big jump is that 8,000. Is everybody okay with that? So we'll just draw a line through there. Okay. And now we'll say, okay, which ionization energy is that big jump in between? Okay, so this is the first ionization energy. To designate it, we write that. This is the second ionization energy. So remember what ionization energy it's removing removing, removing an electron, okay? So this is how much it takes to remove the first one, second one, third one. And then fourth ionization energy is very high, okay? So this is similar, not before. this is similar to what we were talking about with the last problem. Why did it stop uh, make, making its first ion at the D block, right? Because it was very stable at that point. In fact, the reason why there's such this big jump is because at this point, it's very stable, okay? In fact, at this point, it's made its um, noble gas form of its ion, okay? And since we say this is a period three, it's not the first one in period three, it's not the second one in period three, but it's the third one. Is everybody okay with that? Okay, so effectively what we've made here is Al3+, plus, right? So this would be like Al2+, plus if you could think about it that way, and this would be Al+, plus. okay? So it takes a lot to make Al4+, plus, right? So that ain't going to happen. Okay, so um, what, what have we figured out? Well, that the period 3 element is aluminum. Everybody got that far, right? Um, I don't know if it said write the common ion, but if you wanted to, that's the common ion. And you can figure it out. If you couldn't remember from the periodic table, you can figure it out through the ionization energies. And then it says write its electron configuration. And I guess at this point, we might as well do it since we can do it in our sleep, right? So 1s2, 2s2, you guys can help me if you want, 2p6. 3s2, 3p3, okay? So that's the electron configuration of the atom. 3p1. Oh, 3p1, sorry. 3p1, thank you. Any questions? You guys got it, right? Should we do another one of these? Or? Yeah. You want to do one more? No more. <laughs>